Hey guys, how's it going? Uh, just got myself out of the rookie class, got myself a D license in iRacing, and picked up the Sky Modified slash Whalen Modified uh, car pack. So I figured I would try it out here at Thompson. Uh, me and my dad go to the Sunoco World Series of motorsport racing. And uh, yeah, there's a ton of modified divisions that race. Valenti Modifieds, Whalen Modifieds, uh, some mini mods, I think they call them. Uh, then there's Midget Series, Street Stocks, all that kind of stuff. But one that we always watch is the uh, the Valenti Modified race. So um, SK Modified's close enough. So I figured I'd take that car on this track and see what it's like. Interior-wise, this car is amazing. We got our uh, push to start over there ignition not sure what the other button does um, got a few other uh, a few other things yeah it looks very very close to the real thing um, yeah, having those pit passes and looking inside the car it definitely looks almost identical to this a uh, little sheet of uh, glass in the front to keep the glass out or keep the uh, the bugs and stuff out Cage. But yeah, open wheel racing is going to be fun in the uh, Class D series. I've been watching, I think they have a slot at 8 o'clock, so I'll be trying to hit that uh, at least once a week and compete in the next season as that comes about. Sounds good. Got our RPM gauge, got our fuel gauge. All that seems to be working. Got a little shifter there. This is a three speed or three gear uh, gearbox. We got first, second, and reverse. Well, it's pretty easy to get get up to speed. We'll just do a few laps, show you how the car is. Try to get used to how it handles. But it's, it's really cool, almost nostalgic to be in this car now on this track. Um, having been in the stands, we usually sit right over there. Um, we sit over here as well. And because we have the pit pass, usually a lot of this is, or no, it is trees there. But they, they do have bleachers here that they're missing in this game. But uh, we'll park over in those bleachers every once in a while. It's way loud over there. You can really feel the uh, these V8 engines slam through you. Um, yeah, these cars are a little over 2,000 pounds. Like 2,300, something like that. And then they've got a, uh, a small block V8 powering them. You're looking at quite a bit of horsepower. And the Whalen Modifieds are even more powerful than these are. Um, but I can already tell from racing street stock that these... These are whipping around the course. little more grip with these bigger tires. Super fat tires. You almost don't even need a brake though. Just let off a little bit or maybe I'll try just a little bit of brake coming at the end of that corner. Just to get the car almost turned in. And then back on it to keep it balanced on the way out. And then back all the way on it on the way out. This corner here eats a lot of cars on race weekend. So I'm interested to see if it's similar in, uh, in iRacing. That corner and then cars usually end up touching through this corner as well. Um, you see a lot of cars crashing into turn one. Maybe they get late on the brakes and fly high. I 
And yeah, that turn three is notorious for just eating up cars. But yeah, I'm liking this car. I'm excited to start tuning it up. Um, figure out what needs to be corrected. I need like more turning. So we'll be, we'll be working on that, doing some tuning, trying to get the car feeling right. And then uh, be cool to get into that season. Uh, the SK Modified Season Class D license and see what we have against some of these other drivers in iRacing. Do one lap here. I think we'll call it a bit. Really push this thing. There we go, that was good. Still about a half second behind our fastest lap. All right, we'll bring it down to the apron. So yeah, thank you guys for watching this video. Uh, I'll be putting out some more iRacing content. And uh, stay tuned for the next video. We may even do some live racing. keep it under the speed limit we might even do some uh, live racing uh, for these eight o'clock uh, escape modified races so if you'd like to come along for the ride hit that subscribe button and I will see you guys in the next video